Hey everybody and welcome back to the channel. It's been a while since I've done a, a YouTube video, a uh, fly time video at that. But I kind of got away from tying flies for a little while. I was focused on painting fishing lures. And with the fall winter transition coming, um, it, it's going to create a little bit of downtime for me. So uh, I figured I would I would share a fly time video with you. This pattern I found uh, scrolling the internet the one day, and I was very intrigued. It only has two two materials technically: um, cognelion for the tail, and three different colors of thread for the body. And then you, uh, I use the the uh, solar as bone bone dry and cure with a UV light. Well, like I said, it only has technically two materials. It has the, the Coke Daily on tailing. And then UTC 140 denier in fluorescent chartreuse. Fluorescent pink. And fire fluorescent fire orange. So... To start this fly off, I'm just going to go ahead and lay a thread base, build it up behind that bead so that way the bead doesn't slide around on you. I'm going to grab some Coke de Leon. Line the tips up. Get a measurement. And go ahead and tie them in. And tie them on top of the Top of the hook shank, a little long, there we go, and then I just take and wrap them fibers all the way back up to the bead, it creates bulk for your, for your body, then go ahead and wrap back, wrap forward, just build a slight taper, Go ahead and whip finish that. And I don't think it really matters what uh, what colors you use as far as um, pattern wise. You can do anything you want. It's, it's your fly. Um, but I'm going to come in with Hot pink for the second one. Go ahead and start it by the bead. I didn't have my bead all the way forward, so it jumped. That's okay. What you want to do is leave some of the green exposed in the back. Just build a slight taper. Then go ahead and whip finish that one. And I don't remember where I saw this. Um, I was just scrolling the internet one day and happened to come across it and I thought it looked pretty cool. And just do the same thing with the orange. And 
try to get it so the thread lays somewhat flat. Go ahead and whip finish that one. And take some of that solar as bone bone dry don't need a whole lot you want enough to cover the whole entire fly though hit it with a UV light And that's it a very simple fly to tie um, very few materials very good beginner fly um, I know this this works well very well on rainbow trout um, especially stocked ones but what doesn't work on a stocked rainbow trout that's very colorful but I hope you enjoyed the video if you have any questions or comments you know, feel free. Um, if you're not subscribed to the channel, uh, please consider subscribing. And like I said, I hope to do more videos in the future. Um, I know I've said that before, but life life gets busy. But I, I would like to make uh, kind of a fly tying series this winter. So let me know what you think. And thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.